Hello, my name is Mr. Quentin Singleton, and I'd like to welcome you to biology. This is a course that I also teach with Mrs. Sherry Barrera in only periods one and two. Thank you very much and enjoy the presentation. We will start by talking a little bit about uh, myself and my background. We will review the syllabus and then we will talk a little bit about contact information, how you can reach myself or how you can reach Mrs. Barrera. To give you a little bit of background information about me, I am from Daytona Beach, Florida. I lived there all my life until I moved to Georgia in 2014. Since 2014, Cambridge High School has been the only school that I've ever worked at here in Georgia. This is year seven for me at Cambridge High School. I am also a graduate of the University of Florida with a Bachelor's of Science degree in biology. Go Gators. What your student needs for this class is a quiet place to work, a functional device with a functioning webcam and microphone. They will need access to ClassLink which every student should have access to that because it provides them information about their textbook and other amazing resources. On Microsoft Teams, your student will be able to access uh, our course each and every day. They will also be able to access weekly lesson plans so that they, they can stay organized. OneNote is another resource that we will be using in the future to help the students with organization and outlook is our email use so we will be contacting students through email and i'll be talking about that in some um, for uh, future slides a notebook for taking notes writing utensils students should have a pencil or pen and paper to write down notes during class time and the online textbook can be accessed through classlink In our course, we will be giving formative and summative assessments. Formative assessments in this class are only to help the students get prepared for the summative assessments. Formative assessments do not count towards the students' grades. They're only to prepare the students for their summative assessment. So currently there are three formative assessment, three or four formative assessment grades in the gradebook that are weighted as a zero. So if the student did not do as successful as they would have liked to, it does not count towards their grade. Summative ass assessments are a little bit different because they do count towards the student's grade and they will be factored in to the final grade. Okay. Again, myself, Mr. Singleton, and my um, other teacher, Mrs. Sherry Barrera, we both are working in on-level biology. Mrs. Barrera works with me first and second period only. And so uh, for my other class periods, periods three, four, and six, um, you can contact me solely. Um, this is our email addresses here. Uh, this is the best way to contact us. Also, another way to stay in communication with everything that's going in on-level biology is to join Remind 101. The text message that you would text is message at DCHB9K, and you will text that to the number 81010. Thank you so much for taking the time to join me tonight to learn a little bit about on-level biology. If you have any further questions, please feel free to reach myself or Ms. Barrera at any time. Have a good evening.